Is it okay to be secretive about your past when you're in a committed relationship? This is a question that I received recently on my advice column that I want to discuss today because it actually is a really good question. How secretive should you be from your partner? How much do they need to know? How much do you have to divulge of who you are and who you've been? Because the past is the past. Welcome to Dear Cyber Suit Vice Talk Show. I'm Susan McCord. I'm the host of the show. And I want to sort of d delve deeper into this conversation because there is some conversations that you just don't want to have with somebody. You've gone through something that was maybe pretty traumatic for you but in the past and you don't want to rehash it again. You want, don't want to bring it up. So do you feel like you're being sort of secretive and hiding from your partner if you're not telling them about something that was really detrimental to your life. So this is sort of a tough question because you really want to share as much as you can with your partner so that there's nothing that's sort of left unsaid that's going to pop out and rear its ugly head later on in your relationship and get you in a lot of hot water. But in the same breath, isn't there some things that you can hold back and you don't have to share with your partner? If there were some things in your life that were just really embarrassing and really heartbreaking to you, do you really want to share that and bring it back up again with them? I guess you have to ask yourself, sort of weigh it all out and say, okay, would I want to know this if my partner told me? Would I be okay that they told me this? Or would it change my feelings towards them? Because if you're going to tell somebody something just because you feel guilty that you haven't told them and it doesn't even involve them, you really have to th sit down and say to yourself, is this worth it? What if it changes their feelings? What if they look at me in a different way and think that I'm either, you know, I was a pushover or maybe I've got some secrets that were, you know, sort of uh, illegal and then it, they start questioning your morals and your values and all those other things that go with what you already have established within your relationship. So and if you're feeling super guilty about something and that you think your partner should know because it's going to benefit your relationship, it's going to help them understand you more in your relationship, then I would share the secret. If it's something that you've dealt with, but it's still kind of hindering and lingering in there and, and causing you to have certain issues with your partner because of it, then I would share and explain to them that this is what's going on. Because the more honest you are with them as to why things are maybe going a little awry in your, in your relationship, then it, it can at least sort of maybe help mend what's going on. But if it's something you just want to share because you feel like you should, and it's really kind of a scary thing that happened to you or a really hurtful thing, really sort of weigh it out and say, is this going to benefit my relationship? Are they going to learn something about me that they need to know? Or is this something that's better left unsaid? Because what happened in your past is really none of anybody's business. So as much as we all think that when we get into a relationship that we're supposed to share every little thing, there's some things that you just don't want to talk about and that's okay. I'm not telling you not to be, you know, to hide things from your partner, but if your past way back when had some stuff in it that you've dealt with and you've closed the lid on it, don't bring it up again just because you feel you have to tell them every single solitary thing about you. Leave those there unless it's not going to hurt anybody and you want to share them because you're close to them, but just weigh out how it will change or affect your relationship because that's the important question. So thanks for listening to Dear Cyber Suit today. Please keep your questions coming in. I love hearing from all of you. Leave your comments below the video, like the video, and please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Thanks everyone. Take care. Bye.